Here I am at the Nim Lake Access parking lot. There's my canoe. I'm just here waiting for uh, Lori from the Branches Lodge. And she's going to pick me up in about an hour and take me to Stanton Bay. I organized my gear a bit better on this trip, I think. Um, should be a bit more comfortable. There go the loons. I guess here at Nim Lake, this is part of the Trans-Canada Trail. I don't know if it's all paddle or must be some walking because you have to walk to get to this point. Here's the newer put in at Nim Lake. Uh, the old one was down down a ways, not this fancy. Stanton Bay parking lot, ready to go. Lookout Island, I'll go around that on the right side. So it's this one right here. And on that point, um, be a great place to base camp and fish this lake for a week. the next portage, continuing down the Pickerel River. The rapids coming out of Bud Lake, and now I'm in Fern. Well, I stopped on the island campsite on Fern Lake. It is the island right across from the Bud Lake portage, which you can kind of see in the distance there. It's actually a campsite and portage. I found the Savage Portage over there wasn't where the map showed, um, but looks like it's been 
maintained recently, and that's what the woman at the um, Aquatico office said. This is the channel leading out of Fern to the west, um, to the big portage at the end of the lake. Made it over to Sturgeon Lake after kind of going right past the portage on Oliphant. Caught a few fish over there even though I wasn't really trying that hard. Kind of to the south, try to get in that uh, channel to Russell. This is where John and I camped last year for two nights on Russell Lake. I was going to go a little further, maybe to the next lake, but uh, I was catching some fish down in the channel and this campsite was open, so I pulled over and decided to stay. Seems like home. Well, there's the campsite right there. It's a great place. Just cross this little open area, big waves. The wind died right as I was coming out, luckily. A nice maple tree to mark the beginning of the portage from Russell to Chatterton Lake. Oh yeah, this is the part I like the most. Look at that. Beautiful evening on McDougal Lake. This is why I love coming to Quetico, right here. 
Just had a big fish dinner. Got a fire. Sun finally came down across the bay. It's cool now. Everything's good. Look at this rock. It's just like balanced. I bet you I could tip it over. Thing has been sitting there for how many thousands of years? 10,000, 12? Since the last ice age. I'm the only one on this lake. These are all red pines. Kind of similar to ponderosas. I went for a swim earlier in this bay to cool off, clean up. It was perfect. Kind of cold, but uh, that's what I was looking for anyway.